Hi guys, it's me Malcolm, the movie wizard of Oz himself, and I'm here to discuss my review on one of my favorite movies back in the 2000s that I should have done a long time ago. In fact, I was going to do this do this yesterday, but it there were some complications, complications around that time, but I'm free to do it right now. Dodgeball, a true underdog story, starring Vince Vaughn, Ben Stiller, Christine Taylor, Justin Long, and others. Boy, this, we have a packed, packed cast, cast in this movie. I, I just love it. Time until the night falls, everyone will stay together till the battle is done. I love every single meal of Dodgeball. It was, it was so funny. It was a knockout, literally. It was, it was amazing and, and it, and sometimes it could be a little gross out. I mean, I really do admire it. I do admire both versions of it, both the original and the unrated, how we get to see scenes things that we haven't seen in theaters so you know you know back in the day it, it was kind of funny and, and ironic because I haven't seen this in theaters but still still it was quite enjoyable to, to watch. watch in fact there was a time that I could have done this around 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 for Justin Long for his birthday, I could have done this review in honor of him, but I missed it. But not anymore. I, but I really do love Justin Long in this movie. He, he was one of those breakout characters, you know. I really do admire, admire how we could see a little bit of cheerleading in this movie, along with his crush Amber. It, it really was a callback to bring it on. Uh, plus, I really do admire the kiss scene, scene between him and her. This kiss, this kiss. Uh, it was so romantic. But nothing's more romantic how Owen fell in love, love with, with Fran, one of, one of White Goodman's team members from the Purple Cobras. <laughs> Be young forever. You make me feel like I'm living a teenage <gasps> Talk about opposites attract. It does have that Romeo and Juliet vibe. <laughs> but I gotta give but I gotta give it to Miss Missy Pyle in this one. She really pulls Pulls off quite the makeup in this movie. Movie, kudos. <sighs> what else? What else? Oh, I really do admire Christine Taylor's acting in this one. Well, this is the second time she and her husband Ben Stiller did a movie together after Sue Lander. I, I mean, I do admire her, her being such a badass in this movie with with those dodgeballs. She was. Astonishing. Who got the power? Shinto. Oh, uh, it was. This movie was 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 so epic and badass. I do absolutely love the tournaments. My favorite part is where Gordon Pibbs, Pibbs, who who got got angry, angry at the last minute, minute of the semi-finals when he battled against against those flying cougars. It was it was it was awesome. But I really do like the deleted scene how he how he got how he won a divorce from his wife. It was it was it was quite justice what he did. 
Um, what else? What else? Mm. Oh, and I really did love the sudden death scene. How Peter, Peter put on that on that blindfold and and just accepted his fate. But turns out he dodged the ball ball in the nick of time and aimed it aimed his ball at at White Goodman. Oh, I it was iconic, so iconic. Man, I really did love it how it ended. Especially the shocking scene how we get to see Kate with another girl girl and turns out she was a lesbian. But turns out but she said she's not a lesbian. She's bisexual. <laughs> and I really did love and I really did love it how she straight up kissed Peter like that. Do you know, fun fact, there was also a deleted scene, well, an unrated scene where there was a three-way kiss between, between Peter, Kate, and Joyce. <laughs> it was shocking. Oh, and let's not forget, I really do admire the cameos in this movie. It was awesome. And I really do... Awesome. Like, for example, like I really do admire my David Hasselhoff's like David Hasselhoff's cameo. Your blood like a winter freeze is just like ice and there's a cold lonely light that shines from you. Or Chuck Norris and, and of course Lance Armstrong. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. This is why I love this movie. It it really is a classic. So, for my score for Dodgeball, I think I'll give this one a 10. Definitely a 10. You know, it would be better if they did a, they did a sequel. You know, throughout the years after I saw this movie, I always wanted to see a sequel. Because in my synopsis for a sequel, I do believe that, that White Goodman should come back with a new team and battled against the average Joes, Joes for revenge. <laughs> Can you imagine? Okay, you guys, I guess that's it. If you like this video, like, comment, subscribe, and be sure you all stay safe and stay healthy. Bye.